Zimbabwe lies in a semi-arid region with limited and unreliable rainfall patterns and temperature variations. Changes in climate have resulted in more arid environments for agricultural production, which has shifted Zimbabwe's five main agroecological zones. Rainfall patterns and crop production progressively deteriorate from region one to five. Climate change is affecting uh, many communities worldwide. Zimbabwe is not an exception. The, the distribution of the rainfall is becoming too erratic. We are having too many dry spells now, intra-seasonal dry spells. Kushanduka kwe mga kakwaka konzire sanzara. Tika shaiwa zifuo zikafa. Vana waka shaya mari ukutitiva indese kuchikoro no kutitaisu anane kurima. Takanga tine ngombe zidu, ngombe zikafa. Ngombe zafa tika shaya kutueta sei. Manaire akuita mbora ikeshino. The livelihoods of the poor in Zimbabwe are highly vulnerable to climate change due to their heavy reliance on rain-fed agriculture. If changing climatic conditions continue to expand these regions, traditional agricultural systems will become increasingly unsustainable. Oxfam, in partnership with the Zimbabwe Meteorological Services Department, MSD, the Department of Agricultural Technical and Extension Services, Agritex, are implementing a climate change adaptation project called Strengthening Weather and Climate Change Information Dissemination Systems in Zimbabwe in 15 wards of Chirumanzu, Gutu and Zishavani districts. Oxfam work on the climatic change uh, program is very much focusing on the issue of climate change and the impact it has on small farmers. We all know that climate change is already happening for 50, perhaps even 100 years, uh, and we need to address it in, in a structural and in a long-term way. The project's main focus is on strengthening uh, or contributing to the resilience building or small to farmers to weather variability and climate change. So it puts much emphasis on improved access to weather and climate services for the small to farmers so that whatever decisions that they make uh, that are related to agriculture, uh, that they may be informed by scientific weather information. The climate change adaptation project has three expected results. One, Capacity building of extension workers for analysis of historical climate data, interpretation of agrometeorological information, and mainstreaming climate change in agricultural extension. Two, capacity building of smallholder farmers on climate change and interpreting agrometeorological information. Three, documentation, sharing of lessons learned, and research at local, regional, and global level. Opportunities for collaborative research with academic institutions were noted and Chinoy University of Technology was engaged to take the lead on the research component of the project. We are coming in as Chinoy University of Technology with the research component of the project and Oxfam and MSD and Agritex are doing the practical aspects of the project. So we are playing a very key role of trying to understand from the communities themselves how they understand climate change, how they think climate change impacts on their livelihoods and how they see the role of extension and how we can improve on extension services in the country. This is a disaster risk reduction initiative aimed at improving access to water and climate services for smallholder farmers to enhance sustainable agricultural production. What we see in particular with small farmers uh, who, uh, who lack access to resources, who lack access uh, to information, is that they suffer more from the impact of climate change, that they have difficulties to adapt to the climate change and to come up with responses actually to make sure that they can continue producing for their own livelihoods but also for the community, community and the markets. When we did our baseline, we saw that many of the farmers, they don't get this, uh, the, 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 this, um, uh, the, this information. Timely dissemination of weather and agrometeorological information from ZMSD, coupled by advisory information from Agritex, is a key component of the project. 
Yes, when you look at uh, the exchange system, it has been largely focusing on providing information on agronomy, marketing, and with little, little regards to when the information because there's very little, there was very little you know, uh, recording stations or even data interpretation of this uh, weather and climate information. So with this project, what we have seen is that most of the extension workers have been capacitated in such that they'll be able to interpret the climatic events and make and make information, make it in, in extension messages which are aligned to the changing climate. Takabatana, Tibatra, Neo Oxfam, Takabatana Pamuchete, Neo Meteorological Services Department, Tikavani Chirongwa, Chakutiti, Tisimbi, Se Urongwa, Weather and Climate Information Dissemination, Kutivari Mivagonekuana, Ruzio, Weza Mamire Kunze. Training a climate change adaptation, Yai Twane Agritechs, Pamuchete Neo Met, Vajiwana funding Guvaku Oxfam. Is right out to see Rusivo will do tell one a Nina and the child. Tagata Sanishi Bew Nation for Tinema officers Gagutuana, Jengeta, Vatna with district level. Takawana could this Kokawa, Quita Mabasa, Okuongorora, information analysis, yet data rainfall. Kutuwa Gonekuzo, Batsira, Bagrem, around them, Matin get Chitora, information near weather. Climate change adaptation ni yakandi batsira zvizhinji semurimisi ndava e climate change champion ndakuziva kuti mvura inonaya vhikiri inotevera nekuda kwa 10 days forecast tiri kusangana nawo nema 3 days forecast takasangana nawo panguva yechando you know receive my message pa phone kubva kune MSD a SOCO platform is an ICT platform that is used to push bulk weather and agrometeorological information text messages. We generate a focus here at the Medical Service Department, then we put it in, 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 a, in the a SOCO platform, then it gets disseminated to, disseminated to, uh, to uh, champion farmers, to architects, officers. So these um, chosen farmers then disseminate to other farmers. The project activities included installation of 15 manual and three automatic weather equipment in three targeted districts. Muno machiru manzu, muma wazi six arikuno za sikuwe kwe district. Taka kwanisa kuwa na ma manual weather stations. Ataka batiru wakuisa newe Oxfam. Project yedu ye climate change. I yakati pama weather stations. Muma wazi five. Ma pama weather stations ya arpa shukuru. Chikoro china teacher uninga chitora ma readings. Vano tumizira kumeti kwa rari. Meti ya gamchira ma mirwe kunza uninga tumizi kwa numura iridzi. Vano process ya information yavo. Uvoso yi tumizira muma phone kubarimi. Varimi wano tumirwa ma lead pharmacy. Kana kutiba mwevu wataka saruza isuti kavati zisa. Vanu ima weather champion men. Iba wari pa ma village imwene imu. Ika zino taane ma climate clubs. Ya wari mi atino sangana nao. Uye information uye ni mafoni. Taaku gona kui send that he forward. Kune wango wari mi waku farira. One of the recipients of, the, of our focus are the teachers. The teachers then go maybe to the, to the assembly point in the morning every Monday or Tuesday and then they, they, they tell the students. Then these students now go to their parents then tell, they tell them what the teachers are saying, what the focus is saying. Also this is, it widens our coverage area. Kine weather station ya kapiwa na Oxfam ishibatiriana na MSD. Zitaka mira so mzizi isi njino otora, zinege shoka mira Mamiru ya kunze, kuzia kwa kunze, kazi nenge suwaya maka mira pa kumanairu ya mvura, pa suwari nenge rafura. Tino tumira isi ku mkuru ya Gritex, unoso tumira ku MSD. Tine weather station, ya takai suro kwa wache piru kumano weather station. Every day, teacher anu no itama recordings. Ideni wopani farmer anu ya enda food. Saka teacher anu itama recordings, saka every day, anu communicate ane suwe ku Gritex. Tini kuwa na ma message. I want to this is good. This is it. You are making my No, this is not our country. Mvura, I go now. Mvura, I know. I show my. Tony, I'm building. Tony, I'm out. Zinera, Zinera, Marie, Marie, Nene, 
ni 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 kushaki wakwe mvura ya koko zime ungu wano kuna ungu wano mvura iliku misa pa kungu sifa kwe duko ichi wano ngota mvura ino kuna utakuna sema mira kwa kaita yeshe sote fungu wa tocha mvura ino nae ande tino jikara ande tino jikara sinu kumonte Tia kuto indi. Saka pakazo yama meseji manji. Ano kuna utuwa ya kitu mzawote anu. Hakuna mfura masawati ya kifungi zirai wayo. Isuto itasa la utumdenga tikuwa naso utumfura yari kunaya. Hapa mfura ya isi kudi. Ya isi kunaya. But my message is. Haiti haka atitua wala utumfura yari kunaya. Kana usira mangwana. Shoshua mfura ya haita say. Ya inaya. Saka swa kati mbetira pa kuti. Atina kurasikiru wa nimpe usishinji. Tino receive for my message. Ano baku MST. Ano tibatira utitizo wawo. Tino pawa wanawechi koro information ya kafana na nukuti. Kana ushida kuzoto nora. Ano fana na kuna uza wabere. Kutipa ano fana na kufuki zira makrops au. Aka fana na ni madomas. Kana kudiri zira. Kwa tutipa nye wana wedu wechi koro. Tono uti wari kubudira. Kuna kuti. Kana wako kuziza. Shunu usha wari kuona. Shunu ureruka. Waninge wako tuita praktika wane shunu usha wari kuona. Pano kuti waninge ichingo wa theory. Ni shunu usha asinga nyatu kuntusua usha kamira se. Shunu nyeza kuti mwana angu uzo. Wakunzi kune shunu nzi thermometer. Kune shunu nzi rain gauge. Asinga yoni batika na aripu ashe. Wana kuti thermometer yi rain gauge. Shese. Achikuwa nsa wakutu ito omai. Ma reading, sasa kwa sababu tu wengine kwa kutoa chagat chagat chagat, shaka basi la wana. Tino fara upasi koro pedu kutivane mama ma instrumenta changu tisi nao, akaita unge Steve ni sana screen. Chao kwa nsa ukushwana upasi koro pedu tiki ziza tiki shwana. Tino dzwa shaka re kutika na kuchuo ya chantu, ti fari de makropsi edu shaka tino na dzwa berik. Wandu fomo manuska five ita singa tumboziwa na shono ni kwa wamu. Weather, pa weather station. Kugura pira taka kwanza kuwa ni ma instrumenti ya weather station. Tawa kwanza ku record mvrai nengia naya. The partnership created between Oxfam, ZMSD and Agritex has had the opportunity to engage or interact with the farmers rather than just giving weather updates on electronic media that is far from their reach. For most of the farmers we're saying since the weather stations are in selected areas, it will be a very good idea for those weather stations to be in many areas so that people in Zimbabwe can interact with those weather stations. And if the weather uh, information is coming as measurements within their area, they feel is exactly what they, they require. I mean, they were actually uh, comparing it with the weather report that they get from the television or from the radio or from elsewhere, where they feel perhaps those measurements, they talk about other areas. Now it's in their village, it's in their community, it's in their surroundings, and they value it. Taiwan and Damsu, what is the Mungua, Mashurum, Tegunakuns, one man, Rekuns, or my radios, set up one man messenger. But in Yaku to Kuno Kunzbo, where you go cinema with a station one. Sakatakuna Pua, I mean, information in Ningeri, Yakum is a Kunok. Currently, at least 900 community representatives, that include smallholder farmers, schools, and extension workers, are receiving the information on a regular basis. Churongwai Chikaramba Shiripo, Drukona Kuti Tichaba Sirik, Kubuda Munzar. Nekuti ike shino pandiri pano ini sama ika mandrutozo wa makropsi e kurima ni mamirira aninga kaita kui kunze. Shizizo she weather report shaka antibatsira kuti njiziwe nguwa ino uya mfura. Uye njiziwe kutipa uira mfura apa. Inindi nenge nda ndaka mira se ndo gazirira se. Saka ndaka kuziwa kugazirira. Mfura kuya kwayo. Kunyangu ilishoma, kunyangu ya kawanda. Inindi nenda tosa nunda kagazira. Taito siwa kuti. Makaunui, pula iri kwe ya kawanda si. Kana kuti icha na ya sakadi. Anika pambiwe za takarima, apana mbiwe ya kamburamba. Asi zese kuti febu, chichi, takata tu uzu kwa kari kuti. Hebrua rimpula ya change ya tideirele. Asi kubuku na ananwe, patisi mba takata tu siwa kari kuti mpula ya kadi, ya katu wande. Tuko na isu tigore barimu, rino simuka. Kupa pa point seven ya tina yumu district. Kuinda ku 1.5 tons per hectare. Uye shi, ibabere kikana waka kuwa wako shaka kwana, wanawe chikoro wa vatazi kuinda kuchikoro. Icho chikafu cha avu cha icho chei food security ine nge ili nani? Following this positive response that we got from the community, that this project has benefited them, that now they can make informed decision. And it is only good that we can, that we upscale it to other districts, to other areas. From our engagement with farmers, they've indicated that they've learned quite a lot. 
uh, through engagement with uh, MSD, Oxfam and Agritex and these messages that they are receiving and they've been able to use these messages especially in terms of telling when they should start planting and uh, what seed or what variety they should plant. The success of the project is evident as the smallholder farmers in the project are now employing several adaptation strategies. These strategies include diversification into gardening, planting of small grains, beekeeping, fish farming, conservation agriculture, and water harvesting. Before climate change adaptation, the communities were adversely affected. But now with the climate change, the farmers have adopted mitigatory systems which have now tended to ensure better food security. We really want to equip small farmers, in particular also female small farmers, because they are the backbone of our agricultural system, um, to develop um, production methods with which they actually can uh, offtake the, the negative consequences of climate change. And while it was predictable in the past when farmers could start planting, uh, because the rains would come at certain days. This is no longer so predictable as it used to be.